Hey, Project Seekers, it's me, Paige Larson, your teacher for Let's Science at Home. So I'm down here in the little corner. Um, I'm going to walk you through what you guys are going to do um, for class every day. So I'm here on the Project Seek Weebly. Um, if you go over to classes, you'll then see Let's Science at Home, and that's where we'll have all of our information. And you can see here I have our little description. And then I have a really rough daily plan on what we'll do each day. Um, I only have the first three days done so far. I have a materials list here. I'm sure most of you guys have seen that as well. Um, for the most part, all these things um, are pretty self-explanatory. You should have it in your home. Um, and there's not too much stuff that you go out to buy. Um, but we're not going to have a Google Classroom. Instead, I have a Google Site. Um, that I kind of want to have all our information stored in. So you need to click right here on class site and it will bring you to my Google site um, so you can kind of see what's going on. So hey look there's me again. So let's go through what we need to know. So on that front page I have our Let's Science daily plan um, and everything like that. If you need to contact me here's this. Um, our Flipgrid code is here, and then I'm also going to put a link to our YouTube channel. Um, but what we're going to do, if you just click on that little arrow kind of down here, or you can click on the slides, um, it will go to where you need to go. And I give you kind of a breakdown minute by minute, um, hour by hour, what we're going to be doing each day. So uh, we're going to start class usually probably about 8.30. I will not be online at that time. That's for you to start yourself. What you will do is you will go ahead and watch the video of the experiment of the day. Make sure you follow all the safety um, instructions and then you'll do the experiment. Now the video is going to be linked here and I'll also show you where else it's going to be. Then it talks about doing a flip grid and all those different things. Um, this video is here. I put my face right there. Look at that. Um, is where that's going to be kind of talking about what's going on. So like I said, experiment of the day, you can click up here on the top of the tab. I'll bring you to the experiment of the day. What I need you to do with each experiment is what you're going to be filling out this little form. So you can just go ahead, put your email address. That was not so more, much important. Um, put your name, the experiment you're doing, and then tell me what do you think is going to happen. So do this before the experiment even starts. Then do the experiment. Tell me what happened. What did you see, feel, hear, smell, or taste? Not all of those are applicable for each experiment. Um, why do you think this happened? And then what did you learn slash take away from that experiment? And that's it. Hit submit and you're good there. What I want you to do while you're taking the um, or watching the experiment happen, I want you to go ahead, take a Flipgrid video. Um, Flipgrid is pretty simple. If you click right there on the green plus, it will bring you to this site here. It will probably ask for you to sign in for something. Um, make sure you're recording on the right one. This one's for plant observations, which we'll get to later, but you're going to want to start with experiment of the day. So you just got to click on the little green plus and then go ahead and log in and it's kind of self-explanatory from there, making a nice little video. When you are going to be doing the experiment, here I have day one, what we're doing, the different experiment, what materials you will need, and then also a video of me explaining the experiment. It is very important that you do not lose this sheet of paper right here as it has all our materials that you'll be needed for that. But I've also posted that on the side here and I'll be putting in more videos as we go. Um, so that's kind of just how to start off on experiment of the day. Um, as we're going through back to our daily plan, we're going to have that morning meeting, which is going to take place at 930. It's not going to always take that long. Some days it's going to take longer or shorter, um, depending on what we got going on. But that morning meeting really is going to be explaining what we saw happening in the experiment of the day and then introducing our challenge or engineering kind of thing that we got going on. Um, I will tell you on days that we have our plant lab, especially this first day, um, it's going to be a lot longer. And remember that Google Meet. Um, for our morning meeting was sent to you in that first email. Um, I'll be putting it out with this video as well. If you have questions, let me know. Otherwise, let's do some science. Bye.